Hello, in this video we're going to show you the armature object which is a custom object right here. The armature object allows you to use exported animation from Coca Studio version 1. So in version 2 there are different ways but in, you can use some old animations as well. So we just drag on armature onto your scene you basically have this little object and if you scroll down there's a few basic properties you can select a different file which we'll do in a moment actually I'll do that now so if I click file it needs to be a dot export JSON and now that I double, double click that if I just open this directory this imported a bunch of other files as well, a P list and an image with all the different frames of the animation, which were actually on my desktop and it automatically imported them. So I'm show them there because it doesn't you don't need to be dragging them on, you don't need to deal with them. So the next thing is animation list. So if you have multiple animations in the file, you can switch between it. What I'll do is just click reset and I can switch between a walking animation and a standing animation. As you can see, his head's tilting and his leg. Let's just go back to walking. Actually, what I'm going to do uh, is just drag on another armature. Actually, I don't know why I did that. Select this armature, and I'm just going to select my file that I've got right here. And so you got a few more controls. Uh, so you got loop. If you were to get rid of loop and click play, it plays the animation, but obviously it doesn't loop, it stops when the animation stops. So if we just go back to loop and autoplay, if I don't select this and I run it, as you can see, uh, I'll, cr I'll make this a little bigger, it's not playing the animation. But if I were to click autoplay and now uh, run it, as you can see, the animation started playing without me doing anything. That's basically what autoplay is and the preview buttons are just for the Coco Studio so you can just see how it looks so if I click play I can click stop play stop play stop and if I click play and then I click play again it just basically resets the animation so that's it for the armature object we're not covering how to actually use your armature object in code and that's because Coca Studio doesn't support that. You have to actually do that in code. But don't worry, there'll be a link in the description to our Cocos API guide which shows you how to use armature in code for Coca Studio X and Coca Studio JS for your project. So check that out. If you have any questions, feel free to Post them on sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash questions.php. Don't worry, you don't need to remember that. There'll be another link in the description for that. And as usual, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.